Welcome to Bale Jumper, watering hole for the dregs of the Dust Bowl. Heard you're in the market for some greens. Maybe. If so, I've got a garden up on the cliff. Everything's yours for the taking. Cool. Assuming there's anything to take, I've intended to it in ages. Here, cliffside key. Mm -hmm. Be sure to keep an eye out for fiends, though. The place is crawling with them. Thanks for the hint. I like. Anything else? Found the one place around here that had a spot of green. But the road there is so rough, I stopped going. I haven't tended to those plants in ages. And I'm sure something's still alive. Okay, okay. And then we're gonna do this in just a bit. I'm gonna take a look around if there was somebody else. But I think it's just him and the card player guy who's left. Yeah, so looks like it. Okay. So, Bartender's Untended Garden. Here we go. I'll wait right here. Leave the green hunting to you. We don't want to get in the way. Okay, so we will be all by ourselves. Yeah, okay, there are some enemies already around. I can see that. A cactor. I need this. I, Dude! Chase after the cactor that stole the greens. Great. Asshole. All right, then. Let's go up here. Don't tell me we have to fight a cactor at the end. There he is. He just left. Still gonna take a look over here because this looks like a dead end. Yep, there's a chest. Mega potions, nice. Cactor, stay. Dude, I don't wanna fight anymore. It's so difficult alone. Uh oh. Okay, we have to go up. Oh, there he is. Um, down, I wanna say. Stay, bastard. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, two death claws. Uh, okay. Nice, I found a materia. What's this? Uh, poison. Okay. Cactus, stay. You bastard. Where the hell are you going? Uh, down there. There's another materia. And a chest. Um, did he go down or is he... I think he went down. Or maybe he went over. Let's just go down first. And here we have... HP up. Another one. And in the chest we will find... A mega potion. Whoa. Right, I think... Yeah, we have to go over here. Yeah, I have a feeling we have to fight a cactor. Look at the walls. Oh no, 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 those are six. I have to fight six? Are you kidding? Okay, uh, no, 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 no. Abilities, assess, character. I got you now. Hitting them with physical ATP commands will pressure them. Though typically too fast to strike, they will be susceptible to attacks when pressured or while using abilities of their own. Ain't dead yet. You're done. Holy shit, I nearly died. Holy shit. Because I got of the sword, I had one HP left. Ha. Huh. Okay, okay. Uh, let's get this. And done with this. Um, beautiful. Yeah, I still gotta take a look around. It looks like there's still... I think that's the way down. Yeah, let's take a look over here. Uh, yeah, don't jump down. I, I need to heal quickly. <laughs> so, let's hope there's no more fight. I don't want to use another mega potion. Beautiful! We're back in prison. <laughs> right, what is this? More money. Julio. Ah, now we're here. Beautiful, very nice. Um, Our boys want handsome bird, you know. We want equipment that'll accentuate his features. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna do this later. Let me just 
Let's see if he has still something to say. Got those greens you were after? Well, good. Guess my hands-off farming method works better than I thought. Cool. Okay. So, let's heal up, and then there is the card game still to do. And there's the man of the hour. Thanks to your efforts. Oh, for Queen's it were those three. Oh, God dang it. <laughs> it's at an all-time high. Which means my profits should be too. You did me a great favor. Take this as a token of my thanks. Before you go, though, I have some cards I'd highly recommend for a player as skilled as yourself. You won't want to miss out. Uh, I bought them all, unless you have some new... No, you don't have anything new. Okay. People lose interest when they start thinking they can't win. That's why it's important to shake things up once in a while. Mm -hmm. By the way, don't breathe a word about this to the folks upstairs. Unless you want to find yourself behind bars again. No, it's fine. You better okay. take home that trophy, you hear? Today's victory will be our stepping stone to the big one. The Gold Cup. I know Pico's ready to win it all, but are you? Well, we'll see. I haven't run, uh, I haven't raced a chocobo. Well, I have raced one at the beginning, but that's actually it. It wasn't even a race against others, it was just against the time, and that was all. Anything else I might have missed? Let me just take a look. Mm, there was nothing new at the community notice board, there was just the one we already did. Actually, we could do this once, the Desert Rush. Yeah, let's just take a look over there, do this once, and then see uh, how difficult it will be. Mr. Gus presents the one, the only, Desert Rush. Yeah, I hate these games. Time only. If you earn the high score, you'll get some rare greens. Oh. Step right up and give it a try. Okay. De-stress like the derelicts of the Dust Bowl by whacking some boxes. Destroy as many boxes as possible within the time limit. Each box broken will add to your score. Reach the target score before time runs out to win. In order to break gear boxes blocking your path, you must first destroy enough shock boxes to power them. Devise a plan of attack using the hit activated elevators to move between floors and whack your way to victory. Aha, hit activated elevators. Okay. Okay, we need at least 15,000. Dragon Claws would be nice. Hmm. All right, I want to try as long as I have to to get the Dragon Claws, to be honest. Yeah, let's see. Find something else, okay. Let's 
go up here. Go higher. Oh, here. Uh, on we go. Oh, it's gonna be close, maybe. Up here. Come on. That'll do. Done it. Nice. Yes. Forty-four, one fifty. I'll take it. Uh. Are there some down there? I don't care. Can I jump down? No. Okay. Let's just let the tire run out. Okay. Second try! Nice! Yeah, the first one I still needed to find a way where to go and what to do and stuff, and I was way too slow, but this was nice. 44k. I like it. Great job out there! Got some greens for you, Whew. as promised. Yeah, I get more than that. Dragon Claws, the Lord of Atifa, and Gil as well. Sure. Uh, no, we're done for now. Oh, don't tell me you're not interested. Uh, Six is plenty. Pico will get sluggish if he eats too much. Let's check in with Esther. Okay, so six is enough. Can we actually... No, we can't hit those. Okay. Well, Tifa isn't in yet, but still, we can take a look at her new weapon. Or her new gloves. The Dragon Claws. Gorgeous gloves with a dragon scale design. And the ability is Star Shower. Unleash a flurry of powerful strikes. Increases strength of next command executed. Ah, nice. Proficiency bonus. Follow up with an offensive ability or spell after using the weapon ability. So then you should wait till you have two ATP bars and then use it. Okay. It only has two slots. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the Kaiser Knuckles in just a bit. Just wanna see... What we have here... Martial Arts Mastery increases the duration of Unbridled Strength by 50%. Enhanced Techniques increases damage dealt by unique abilities by 15%. Attack Power plus 20. Attack Damage plus 5% increases damage dealt by basic attacks by 5%. Magic Attack Power plus 20. And Weapon Ability Damage plus 5%. Okay, sure, at this point I don't even know what to take. Uh, let's take this one. And attack power, I don't know. But we're gonna switch it back to the other ones first, just to get more AP. Alright then, so it looks like there's nothing else to do. We're gonna take a look at the tag shop first, and then we're going over to the Choco Boutique to gear up for the race. Ah, I don't have any more plumes. Hmm, I still need more. I need six, I have two. Okay. Ah, I need those to upgrade some stuff. Actually, I, should, I could get it right away. All right, there was something. Wait, wait. Right, we can craft the headband. Let's do that. Cool. Uh, what do we need? I think I just want to upgrade or craft as many as possible as I can right now. Let me just buy what I need, and then that's good. Oh, I, I don't need to buy any of these because uh, I have the required amounts already. I'm missing some other stuff. Okay. Then, never mind. <laughs> Go on and make them as flashy as Gus. Right then, let's feed our bird. Wrestled up some quality stuff, did you? Do I have to do one by one? Yeah, it looks like it one by one. Oh, Pico. It's a start, but nowhere near enough. Yeah, yeah, we do have more.
It looks like he only needs three. Yeah, he's looking a lot better now. But we could get him in great shape with a touch more. I want to give him as much as I can. Or as many as I can. Two hearts. Mm hmm. <laughs> goes right as rain and fit to hit the track whenever you are. Oh, okay, so three would have been enough. When you're okay, ready to I got to six. The stadium, hmm. Just speak to your babysitter over there. <laughs> oh, before you go, if you happen to have any more greens, consider trading them in for racing gear. Oh, I can. Vegetables cool. Vegetables are hard to come by down here, so I'd be happy to buy yours. Sure, sure. If I can't eat, well, make him eat more. No, that's actually it. Okay, Esther's tech shop. Let's talk to her. Ooh, looks like you brought the good stuff. Ah, gi headdress and cloak and leg wraps. This is a uh, Gina Tak. We will see him much later in, uh, ooh, what's the name of Nanaki's home with Bugenhagen? Oh, I forgot. I will see. We'll, we will go there at some point. I'll get all, all of those, definitely. Julio, thanks. Well, that's all I got. Now go and kick the tar out of those other jockeys. All right, can we somehow change its appearance? Ah, here, here. Wait, do we have something to say? Goes as ready as he'll ever be. If you can't win, you got no one to blame but yourself. Yeah, I think so too. And my skills. <laughs> so, let's take a look. <laughs> I like this already. I really thought this would somehow change the stats or something. That would have been cool. All right then, I think that's it. <laughs> I like it. Cool, cool. All right then, one last look if I've missed anything, but nah, actually we couldn't do anything with Chadley anymore. We can't go outside to take the picture for snaps. Um, we can't go back. Yeah, I think we just need to finish this first. So let's talk to this dude and then move on. So, you ready or what? To our race. Yeah, let's take a look and do this. About time. Let's get this show on the road. Come with me. Actually, on second thought, I'll take him up top. That work for you? Say what? <laughs> Fine. You want to go rolling the hay with this idiot? Go wild. <laughs> and on that note, follow me. Sure, sure. It's hard to believe this is the same Pico that nearly died in the desert. You should have seen him that first day, the poor boy. More dirt than Chocobo. Couldn't so much as give us a quail without coughing up sand. He's a whole new bird now, though. Might even have what Oops it takes to win. <laughs> Question is, do you? Even the fastest chocobos can't win Jack without the right jockey. I've seen my fair share of promising birds wasted on riders who didn't know their asses from a hole in the ground. Believe me, in the racing world, it's all about who's holding the reins. No pressure, though. Mm-hmm. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> okay, on you go. Shoot for the stars, if I see it correctly. Mm -hmm. Competing in the race today? Yep. We'll get your bird Yeah, the racing you. music. Just sit tight in the jockey lounge. And no wandering yeah. off, okay? Buck boy. Mm -hmm. No wandering off? Okay, I'm gonna take a look around. <laughs> Maybe we can enter somewhere. Oh, look at the screen one. Cool. Mm hmm the Shinra attire. I have not seen this. This looks like a gold saucer attire. Yeah. Very cool. And it's green, the Chocobo. This one is bluish, gray. And this is, uh, like, the cowboy attire. Nice, nice. What else? He is black on black. This is the standard one, the first one you get, I think, if I'm not mistaken. There's Pico. <laughs> and that's it, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's look that's what it looks like. A bug boy? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> hey there, Joe. Joe, who are you? Why, Esther, you grow lovelier by the day. <laughs> uh-huh, sure I do. Oh, where are my manners? This here's Joe. 
He's one of Sam's jockeys. <laughs> and as much as it pains me to admit it, the man's far and away the best rider in the sport. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. Kay. This is Cloud, an up-and-coming star of the track. And all ours. Be sure to wave high when he laps you. <laughs> wow. That's optimistic. Sounds like you got a fan, son. I wonder, though, you win her over with your skills? Or with one of them smoldering looks. <laughs> you want to talk? Don't all dressed up and stuff. About time I had some competition. Assuming Esther's not full of it. A little bit like For both Irvine. Sakes, Irvine Kinney's. Yeah. From Final Fantasy VIII. Forget him. The race is starting soon, so stay focused. Speaking of, you might want to consider practicing. The sim here can help with that. I think practicing is not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, we're gonna do this in just a bit. Still gonna take a look around to see what we can see. Anything useful, anything... Hello. Your first race ever, and it's with Joe. So? Well, try not to get trampled out there. Hmm, okay. This looks actually like uh, cotton candy, in a way. Oh, that's nice. Bunch of food. Oh, actually, I'm getting hungry. Oh, shit. I will beat Joe. I will be famous. I will beat Joe. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to manifest a win here. <laughs> okay. Quark! 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 What's wrong with I'm you? I'm just brushing up on my bird calls before the race. Do you think you need bird calls, really? Or we could team up, take Joe down a peg. Or? Or what? what's the first part then? Aw, a bug boy. I'll go easy on ya. Okay, this was the wrong way around, girl. Not gonna do a few laps for practice? I am gonna. Not gonna do a few laps yeah, 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 for yeah. practice? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. Yeah, let's do this. Just to see how it goes. Right, racing simulator. Oh, wait. What is this? There are some, like, boxes and stuff. No, not boxes. What is those? Oh, those are like, like gazelle greens or something. This is food. Oh, it's so that look like uh, boost ups like in uh, Super Mario Kart. Okay. Okay, you can jump. I didn't know that. Cool, cool. All right. If you want to brush up on your jockey skills, you can practice on the racing simulator. Even if you have never raced a day in your life, completing the sim's various tutorial objectives will ensure that you are ready to compete. Ah, okay. So we will have to do a bunch of stuff, a bunch of tutorials. We're going to do this, of course. Controls. Steer with the left stick, speed up with X, slow down with circle. Do we have to hit it once or keep it pressed to speed up? I want to say maybe mash it. Left stick and R2 is drift. Press X right when the countdown hits 2 to begin the race with an explosive start. Or you say press. So am I holding it or is it press and hold? I don't know. You may end the simulation at any time by pressing the options button. Okay then. And the countdown hits 2. Yeah, actually, I think this was the same with Super Mario Kart. Yeah, as soon as it hits two, I think two, not one. Yeah, I think so. Hmm. Right, let's practice. Well, I did it, but... I think you have to hold it. Uh, the more of these blue balloons you collect, the faster your chocobo will run. Each balloon raises a bird's speed level by 1 for a maximum of 10. Note that when you run into obstacles or collide with other chocobos, your speed level will decrease. Oh, okay, be careful, not with the others. Can I get more than one? Can I... Hmm. Ability Balloons. Collecting these red balloons will fill your chocobo's ability gauge. Once the gauge is full, press L1 to activate your chocobo ability. Remember that each type of chocobo has its own unique ability. Okay. Dash Balloons. Collecting these yellow balloons will add a charge to your dash gauge. As long as you have at least one dash charge, you can press R1 for a short burst of speed. You can only stock as many charges as there are in your dash gauge, though, so use them when you can. Right, uh, speed burst is down there. Dash, okay, two. So I'm gonna keep one for rainy days, so to say. Yeah. 
Oh, 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 okay. I wanted to drift, but somehow it didn't work. Ah! I think you should just dash if you need to. Um, yeah. Ah, okay. I mean, like this. Yeah, okay. Ah, I needed to be good to go in under 30 seconds. Okay, okay. I just made it. Nice. Okay. This is more difficult than I thought. Okay, okay. Enter the Chocobo Cup. Now that you have completed the tutorial and learned the ropes, you can race in the Chocobo Cup. Good luck. Press options to quit the simulation and start your career as a jockey. Sure. I got 50 G. Is this like gill or is it some... Oh, gold saucer points. Hmm. This might be it. Practice makes perfect. Okay, okay. Sure. I think we should just get started, right? Hyperion is Joe's bird, and it's a fast and rapid Hyperion. Son of a bitch. Things okay. Line. Hyperion was the name of the I want to say yes, evil factory or something in Borderlands, right? Um, can we go, please? Our next race will begin shortly. Okay. All participating jockeys, please proceed to the paddock. Finish and first. Good to go? Oh, okay. Well, I have to. Let's do this. Aye, my goodness. Chocobo attributes. Each bird is unique, but they all possess the following attributes. Speed, acceleration, weight, cornering, strength, and intelligence. Depending on the distribution of these attributes, a bird can be fast or easier to handle. For a more in-depth breakdown, speed and acceleration will obviously make chocobos run faster. More weight will make them fly shorter distances but also be harder to knock around. Cornering helps chocobos turn better, strength keeps them from slipping around, and intelligence affects the potency of their chocobo ability. What the hell? Gear. A chocobo can wear gear on three different parts of their body, the head, torso, and legs. Each piece of gear has its own set of attributes that can augment your chocobos. In addition, gear comes with a unique skill that activates automatically when you meet its conditions. You can save up to four sets of gear, three racing sets and one world set, which is the gear your bird will wear while it shuttles you around the world. I really thought so. Holy shit. Ooh, this is less speed. It's more speed. She's more intelligent. I think I have to mix it up. Just that I have um, the best stats that I can think of. So let me just take a look and then... We'll see. You know what? I'm gonna try it with the Merc build. This will give me the most speed, to be honest. All the others are not really better. The Gin attack would be maybe better for weight and for acceleration, but I think I wanna have most speed as possible and good cornering and strength and stuff. Yeah. Let's try this. Sure. Let's hope we're not too heavy. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Here's a secret. I survived that recent shooting. You're not talking about the Colosseum, are you? <laughs> yes, I was there. Or I would have been had I not gone to the bathroom just before. That's amazing. <gasps> so you didn't so survive the shooting. Aren't I just? <laughs> not Which really. is why I know my bird's a winner. <laughs> Ooh, what a scrumptious looking parfait. And with plenty of butterscotch, I see. Bottoms up. Ooh. <laughs> Looks delicious. <laughs> 
<laughs> Too bad I couldn't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Got eyes on him. Oh, I'm fine, thanks. <laughs> Do you know how hot it is out here? I'm melting. Maybe you should switch your outfit? <laughs> God, what asshole decided our uniforms had to be black? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there as soon as I can. You freaking better. And bring something cold to drink. Or better yet, ice cream. Is vanilla No, okay? vanilla. <laughs> Seriously, I'm getting heat stroke over here. I'm gonna die. You want that? Do ya? <sighs> Wish you were here, partner. All right, then. Let's try this. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, you bastards. Oh, you got mine. I wanted that. Did you just get rid of my... Mm, of my boost? I missed it. Are you kidding? Maybe I shouldn't go. Ah, oh, shit. What? I didn't get anything? Are you kidding? I nearly got you, buddy. I'm in first. Oh, I missed them all. Sure. And this looks like an easy win. I like. Coolio. So maybe, yeah, speed was a good choice. You're not Michael I Jackson. Stop it. Winner. You're the real deal, kiddo. I just provided the encouragement. And thanks to you, my prison's gonna be a goddamn palace. Good for you. Ooh, so frosty. But here in the desert, we like it hot, fiery, dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. Now where's our guy? <laughs> Easy, Snowflake. Solemn Gus is a man of his word. Are you scared I'll break my promise?
That tunnel over there will take you where you need to go. Past all that quicksand like a slippery little sidewinder. And at the other end, one of my beautiful vultures will be waiting to guide you through the desert. So be a good tourist. We got old Shooty McShooterson tied up nice and tight in a shack out in the scrapyard. But now he's all yours. Turn him over. Give him his just desserts. It's your call to make. Okay, then. We got our party back. Awesome. Slippery Sidewinder. Sure, sure. So, one last look. Yeah, yeah, we could still go down there and do this fight and stuff, but no, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna do this later. I will come back at some point. I'm quite certain we can come back to Coral Prison. Because we have to, because there's still one guy we need to fight sometime uh, when it comes to cards. So, this will come soon. No, not soon, but this will come also later. <laughs> All right, then. On we go. Hey, shouldn't you be somewhere doing something? <laughs> He's still trying to be MJ. Ah, so funny. Don't suppose you're in the market for a charming young racing consultant? Uh, not yet, no. You guys moving on then? And what are you gonna do? Since you put Pico's name on the map, we'll stick around for a bit. Try and get a winning streak going. Besides, we still got a score to settle. <laughs> sure you'll be okay on your own? No man with a bird is ever truly alone. Hey, Cloud. I know you need to hit the road, but if you're ever itching to get back in the saddle, come around. Pico will be here. Sure, sure. We'd love a victory lap. Sure, sure. We'll come back later at some point. Right, let's go. There's no way Barrett shot those people, right? Are there any other gun-armed dudes who might have gone on a killing spree? We know him. He'd never do that. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Yeah, yeah, and then we will see that it was actually Dine. Oh, wait, it's the... it's the vulture again. Ah, we're following this one to find Barrett. Okay, okay. Where are we? Oh, we're outside. Oh, wait a second. Can we actually go and do the rest now? I think we can. I think we can get all the Remnant Rave Towers and stuff. But still, we're gonna get Barrett back into the party first. That he can get his, um, his XP and stuff. Let's just follow the bird for now. And then we're gonna clean up the map quickly afterwards. Hmm, it's over here. Not good. What the hell? Uh -huh. Not good at all. Uh -huh. No, not good at all. Where did this come from? Run! Ah! Damn it! This way! Barrett! Move! Chewing on sand for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. Thank God we found you. We were worried. You on the lamp, big guy? The hell I am. <sighs> what are you guys doing all the way out here anyway? Looking for whoever decided to shoot up the Coliseum lobby. They said the culprit had a gun for an arm. True. <sighs> they did, huh? Tell me it wasn't you. Frankly, it might as well have been. Hmm. Yeah, he feels responsible Barry, for dying. Talk to us. I know the man who murdered all those people. Dine. My best friend. 